It seems likely that teachers and other staff in our schools will soon have to show a vaccine pass to get to work, but it's not expected to happen anytime soon. The Central Okanagan School District has told the province that they should be the ones making the decision, but as of now, it's up to different school districts. So they're seeking advice on how to go about doing it. They're not even sure how teachers will react. In fact, neither does the teachers' union. The range is all over the place. I don't know how many on each end, uh, but I've heard both sides from our members. Absolutely, there is a range of opinion. So with what you've heard so far, you're not prepared to advocate in favor of having a VAX pass requirement at schools? No. Uh, our position is absolutely that we would support a vaccine mandate. Um, but we really believe it should be a provincial call, not the patchwork 60 different school districts making the decision. Uh, there are a few things that for us would make the vaccine mandate if it were to be, if it were to be. We would insist or, or request that it be a fair process, Kent, that um, privacy be, be maintained that um, there are accommodations made for legitimate reasons. Those kinds of things need to be identified uh, before they can make the call. If we get to a point where there is such a mandate, it would still be one of the jobs, I think, of the Central Okanagan Teachers Association to look out for the rights of those who, for whatever reason, don't feel they can fit in. Our job is to represent our members, Kent, and on this one it's hard. I won't lie, because there are the different views. So I'm trying to maintain an up-the-middle approach. Right. Um, but you also have to make sure that people who, for whatever reason, aren't willing to provide vax proof aren't mistreated by their employer as a result. A fair process, like I say, absolutely. And privacy is maintained. Do you have any idea why, why the province hasn't just uh, made a province-wide uh, you know, pronouncement on this? Oh, it's probably why I don't run for politics, Kent. Um, <laughs> I, I, I really do not know. They, they, Horgan is claiming the trustees are the employers, and he is right, he is right. Uh, but something like this, I really think, begs a provincial order of some kind, be it from the government or be it from the PHO.